All right, guys, welcome back. Here we are with another wonderful artist here at Fan Expo, Mr. Sean Anderson. And check out his beautiful art. I love it. Look, look at all that beautiful foil work in his prints. And look, it's actually in the prints. Okay, this one's a bad example. But look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, don't tell Josh. Oh, boy. Look at all of that. All right, so what's the inspiration behind your art? I'm noticing some Eastern art styles. Yes, I have a lot of um, Japanese art influences. I Lots of art history, like Deco Nouveau. Um, I, I even, the abstract expressionist. I've been into like Basquiat lately and all that stuff. I'm also looking at a lot of fashion magazines and um, fashion photography because it's just the wildest things that people never really pick up on because it's so mundane to them, but you just apply a superhero to it. It just adds all together. So a lot of fine art that I look at. Beautiful, beautiful. There, and there's a little bit of something for everybody here just about. You've got Marvel stuff. You've got Into the Spider-Verse, X-Men, DC, Power Rangers. you got Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And look at the incredibly creative Star Wars art. So look at this very beautiful Princess Leia inspired design. You can see the Death Star in the background and in front of it is the Rebel insignia. Down below it you've got what looks like an interdictor Star Destroyer. And then over here you've got this beautiful take on the Death Star. I love the floral patterns around the Death Star. You got the TIE Fighter swarming the X-Wings and the Falcon. Fantastic. And then check out check out this Vader over here. Look at that. You got Vader's castle in the background. You've got his tie advanced right there. Magnificent. And there's more here, guys. Look. This female Galactus with the silver surfer. Look how the foil silver streak interweaves into the design. You've got this creative take on the Joker. Baroness, Oscar Isaacs, beautiful, beautiful. So, how long have you been doing this kind of artwork? I've probably been doing, I've been doing the con circuit for probably 10 years now. The, the style, I've probably hitched on probably five, six years ago, where I just started concentrating on, well, I'll tell you a story. My wife looked at one of my art pieces and she said it looked like a photograph. That insulted me, so I decided to go the other way and make it look as artsy and put as much design elements as possible to just create a wholly unique look for my stuff. And uh, do you work in the comic book industry as well? I do do variant covers, um, so I have a couple covers for uh, Something's Killing the Children. I have done The Last Ronin. I have a few coming up in the future, hush hush, but... That's where I'm at right now. And what would you say is your favorite fan property that, that you're a part of? And what would you say is your favorite property to do art of? Uh, that I'm part of? Uh, well, the, my favorite part property I would love to work on is Spider-Men's are easy. Because they, they have a form, a body that you could just mold and play with any patterns. So that's where I like working with. Um, I, I love doing the Something's Killing the Children stuff. It's it's a lot of fun. It's very unique. The characters, it's just, you know, in a world where we're all wearing masks, it just fits for what's going on today. And uh, when I when I said favorite fan property, I meant, like, what's your favorite comic book or cartoon or, or movie franchise? What What's your favorite thing? Um, okay. Uh, my favorite fa property right now, God. Well, my family just started the My Hero Academia stuff, like what everyone's doing. But um, I guess my favorite properties is like I love Mad Men. I love, um, I, you know, the old Breaking Bads, the those shows. Um, I don't know. I, I love like oh, yeah. slow-paced dramas and your quirky comedies, like like Superstore or things like that. I just binge Friends, honestly, <laughs> and I loved it. it just comfort because I'm most of the time I'm just drawing and I'm making art and I just want something in the background I can listen to a good 30 rock in there is where I lines come out and you're just 
laugh every once in a while. That's what I really want. Well, Mr. Sean, thank you so much for being with us. Guys, if you're at this con, if you're coming to us later at another Fan Expo, hopefully he'll be here again and you can come and check out his art. But in case you want to check it out because you're way out of town, here's where you can find him right over here. Here's his contact info. Here's his Instagram. There you go. Sean, thank you once again, and we'll see you later. Thank you so much for tuning in. Like and subscribe to us on social media. Follow us on Instagram, all that good stuff. And find this video on rebelscum.com. We'll see you guys later. We'll see you another time. And may the force be with all of you.